I just went to FedEx and I did the return. It was super easy, super quick, which I loved. And now I'm gonna go into Marshalls because I'm looking for like a little like basket thing. I don't know. And then I'm gonna go to Target, but I just wanted to show you guys my outfit. Super, super, super comfy. I feel like I like, don't mind vlogging in public, but sometimes it's just kind of like, I don't know. Um, but yeah, it got so hot. Or not even hot, it just got really sunny. But I'm still comfy, so that's fine. Um, but yeah, I'm just looking for like little basket things. For maybe like a gift basket, I don't know. This is so cute with Woodstock and Snoopy. I got like a blanket for Jack that has them on it and I just thought like this would be so cute even though he already has like that type of pillow but look how cute that is oh my gosh and it's so soft too I love these types of pillows I didn't find what I wanted which is fine I'm gonna go to Target now and see if they have what I want I just wanted to show you guys what I got quickly um so the reason why i originally had gone to target is because i started using natural deodorant and i just really don't like the one that i'm using like i want to find like more of like a gel one and i've been looking for so long like i've been spending so much time looking online and then i saw at target they have a bunch of the like travel sizes so i was like why not try out a bunch of travel sizes because they're smaller and like I can try out different brands or like different types whatever without having to like spend so much money on it but then I got there and they had none like there was no travel size natural deodorants and then I spent so much time just like in the deodorant aisle just like trying to find a gel one so I think I'll just look online again I guess I don't know and then I just wanted to show you guys what I did end up getting so I just got two of these maple brown sugar what i've really loved well, there's someone driving there's someone pulling up next to me um but anyway so what i've really loved is like putting water in the oatmeal i don't mind i just use water and then putting it in the microwave for 30 seconds and then putting peanut butter and a bunch of cinnamon in it and just mixing it all up and you guys it is so good like i i'm a oh my god it's so good i don't it's just so good um and then I was thinking for lunch, I really want, um, I really wanted a baguette with salami. And then I was looking in the food section and I was, I couldn't find a baguette so I have to go somewhere else because they were all sold out here. But I saw this and it's this cashew milk mozzarella, which I've never ever had before. I've never tried it, but I'm really excited to try it and I, I know it's obviously not gonna taste the same, but I hope it's good. Like when I did eat dairy and stuff, my absolute favorite thing to eat was freaking mozzarella. Like I could, oh my God. I loved mozzarella, like especially like on sandwiches and stuff, or I would just literally just eat it plain. Like it's so good just to eat plain, like just by itself. I'm hoping that this like kind of compares. It looks really weird. I don't know if you can like tell. It looks really, really weird. I actually really like this brand i don't know how to say it me whatever i don't know how to say it but i actually really like some of the cheeses that i've got from them before that are dairy free and i really like them i've been holding on to hope that you'll come back when you can find some peace i just got back and my dad said that he would try one too all that i need is my salami my dairy free mozzarella i'm just gonna do it with my hands because I don't really feel like getting out a cutting board. I'm just gonna split it in half. I feel like this is the best way to go about it. It like kind of has the same texture. Uh, no, this is definitely like, I mean, you can taste the difference. Like I can definitely tell it's not real mozzarella, but for what it is, I actually think it's pretty good. I think what I'm gonna do is just cut it in half like that and then take it out sorry i'm like sorry if this grosses you out that i'm using my hands so much but i don't know what to tell you okay i can't tell if that's like too much I'm gonna add the salami i love 
all types of like cured meat like this. Probably do a few pieces just because I like salami a lot. I feel like pressing it down will make it stay. I should have put olive oil and balsamic on it because olive oil and, bals bals olive oil and balsamic with like French bread and stuff like that and salami is so good. So maybe I'll make like a little sauce. I'm just gonna make my sandwich now while I talk to you guys. I'm trying to think of like what's going on in my life that would be even like remotely interesting. I've just been so stressed lately. Like, I think that's just about it. Like I've just been so stressed um, because I feel like my main stress thing is so for school i have to repeat 22 credits which is over a semester worth of credits which i think anybody would be stressed out by um and so i want to try to get it done still on time so i'm taking more classes than i should be so like right now i'm taking six classes which normally i personally wouldn't do just because it is a big workload so i've just been trying to like manage that and like figure out how to do six classes i'm happy that it's almost fall time i love the fall like i think summer is definitely my favorite but i really do love fall a lot like when it starts to get a bit chillier and like i don't know like the air is like crisp if that makes sense like i love that and then i really love in the fall time like when all the leaves change and stuff like that. I just think it looks so pretty. Um, I just spent two hours on an assignment because it was so difficult and it like grades it right away. I got a zero out of a hundred. So stressful for me like <laughs> I don't ugh. I don't know like the only thing that's good about it is I have like two more tries for it but it's hard because school's always been so difficult for me and I like actually like put in an effort like I tried for two hours straight like, is that not giving it an effort? That's totally giving it an effort. And then I just go to zero out of a hundred. Like, and the thing that is so, that like makes it even better is I have two more of like the same type of assignment that I have to do. Oh my God. I just like, life is so freaking, like it's so stressful for me right now. Like. I feel like there's just so many times where I like stop what I'm doing and I just like stare at the wall and just like think and I'm like, wow, I'm so stressed out. I just feel like I have like a million things going on just like all at once and it's like, it's too much. I think it's just because I'm not used to like, especially with class, I'm just not used to taking six classes, like six classes, like with so many classes, at least for me, like that's a lot. Like if any of you guys do six classes, like each semester, like, Good for you like it honestly is tough for me um it's just a lot i feel like it's so like i feel like i like don't want to let myself be stressed like i want to like my body wants to like turn that emotion off or whatever that like feeling off for like stress like i just don't want to let myself feel stressed because it's just so difficult like you keep it's like, so hard to get out of Um, just wanted to give you guys a little update. So I took another, I mean, it was like an easier assignment, but it's fine. And I got an 100 on it, so we're making progress. Um, but I'm definitely stopping for the night because, oh, I don't know, I just feel like I've done too much, too much homework today. So I'll do it again tomorrow. I don't know, I feel like I'm such like, I procrastinate so much, especially with schoolwork and stuff. But I feel like I'm now starting to get in, like, I'm now trying to 
get everything done early and it definitely makes me feel a lot better and like it is a bit less stressful than how I would do it before which is great um so yeah maybe I'll keep that up I uploaded a video like like an hour ago I think or something so hopefully people like it <laughs> um but yeah I think I'm just gonna get ready for bed it wasn't a really exciting day today if I'm being honest I didn't really do much I think like I did a few things actually I guess I got some stuff when I went out but other than that oh that's what I was gonna tell you guys so this like brand came I was like scrolling through Instagram and this brand came up on my thing and they were like oh like if you want like your dog to like we need dog models whatever blah 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 so I was like you know what like why not might as well give it a shot <laughs> so I sent them this picture of Magnum because if it's gonna if you can even see it like he's just so cute and then with his little like legs also we got him this duck I don't know like a while ago like I don't know like a week ago or something we got him this duck when we were in Brewster and he like is obsessed with it he loves it so much um it's like his best friend it's so cute I don't know if I'm even gonna put this video up if I'm being honest I don't have Phil but I will have to say okay well if this does end up going up and I post it, then I'm just gonna say thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope that you guys enjoyed. Sorry, it was kind of like a boring, didn't do much, whatever, not very exciting type of day, but I really hope that you guys still enjoyed and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Also, I don't know if this is just like a me thing. I feel like lately I've been like watching back some of my old videos and stuff from like posting. And I don't know why, but like it literally makes me smile and like laugh so much. Like I genuinely am, am like my own best friend. And like I was telling Jack, like I'm my number one fan. <laughs> like not in like a weird way, but like I don't know. It just makes me so happy just like seeing myself. And like I think this is a great thing to do. Because then I can always like look back on these videos and be like, oh, like I remember that and that happening. Because I feel like that like with YouTube, like it's easier to kind of see that because it's like you're vlogging like over like a day or something like that where it's like if you take a video on your phone like it's just like a few seconds or something so I feel like this gives me a better idea especially because I have a really bad fucking memory like a really bad memory so this like helps me and I think will be great for when I'm older and I can always like just like look back on it and I don't know it's just like so exciting for me and like even though I probably watched all the videos like millions and millions of times every single time I like watch it it just like gives me so much joy okay sorry to add on like a, yet another thing but I was just thinking about it and I was like why did I say that I might not post this like I feel like that's such like a I shouldn't say that because I feel like I vlogged for a reason today or because like I wanted to so like why wouldn't I put it out there and like if people don't like it they don't like it like I don't know like I obviously wanted to vlog today and I feel like I should post it like I feel like I shouldn't be oh I shouldn't I don't know if I'm gonna post this blah, blah blah even if it is like a boring day like maybe some people or even just like myself like find like that interesting or like would enjoy watching that I don't know but yeah I just like keep thinking about things and like things keep coming up and I'm like oh my gosh like I need to tell like I need to say that to my um vlog and like let it like let them know oh also okay you know what never mind I'm just gonna cut it off here probably watching tv or something i don't know but all right bye again okay i'm back it's not only like it's not like this is like the first time i've noticed but my hair you guys i think it looks so cool because the thing that i love about it is so i have been literally through hell and back with my hair like i just <laughs> I just have no, I don't know, I'm just, I have like, I get these ideas in my head and I'm like, oh my gosh, like I need really short bangs, like I'm gonna do it myself, blah, blah, blah. And then I end up looking terrible, like ever since I was young, like literally ever since I was young. I've just been like, like cutting my hair like crazy. Yeah, like when I was like really little, not really little, I was like a bit older, I cut my bangs to like he, literally like here like it was so bad and 
I wore a headband like this for so long. Like literally for so long. I had to find pictures of it. It's so funny. Over quarantine, I cut my hair. I think I mentioned it before. I cut, I tried to do those like cute. And I just like, I feel like once I start cutting, like I have to keep going. Like I, it's just, I don't know. It just gives me so much, um, whatever the word is. And I just have to, like, I just kept going. Anyways, besides the point. When I was in college, I boxed out my hair and I like went through all of that and everything. And like, it was really bad and like, it just like destroyed my hair color or whatever and that was after i got this balayage so i was like worried i was like oh my gosh like my balayage is never gonna come back and the box dye like eventually washed out and i got my hair done or my hair re-dyed twice i think at like a professional place and those like they both washed out and everything thank god because then my balayage finally came back and like i've been thinking about it recently i know i've been thinking about it for like a longest time like literally whenever i look at it because I personally, so these are my, this is like my root color. And then obviously this is like not my natural color. But I had gotten the balayage, I don't even know, like a, literally like a few years ago. I went to my mom's hairdresser and he did such a good job because it's just faded so well and like it's grown out so well because it's not like, it's not like drastically, you can't tell like, oh, like she got her hair dyed, like you it just like looks so natural the way that it's grown out but it's literally been years like it's crazy how long this has lasted which is so awesome i literally have been looking at jack's like hockey website religiously because they haven't posted the schedule yet like they're they just like whoever's running this has not posted the schedule and i'm just waiting like i want to see the freaking schedule like i want to know when they're playing whatever so like if anybody's watching this that runs this website the point streak whatever you guys should put the schedule on so i can see it i am super happy about it because they jack told me today they started this like someone started this like instagram page or whatever for their team and i went on it to go look because they have a game tonight and i went on it to go look to see if there's any updates or anything and they took a video of like some of the goals and stuff and jack scored a goal and i got to see it which is so exciting i don't know it just makes me so happy just like seeing him play i don't know why it's just like so exciting even though it's like not in person like i'm not seeing it in person but like still but yeah i want to go see one of the games in person so maybe if they posted the schedule i could like figure it out i don't know but i literally check it all the time like i <laughs> it's like embarrassing how many times i check this and it just says the same exact thing over and over again that there's no schedule out maybe one day it will come out <laughs> i just like i don't know i feel like i've always been so entertained by like talking to myself i don't know if that's like self-centered or whatever but like i feel like i'm like truly like i'm like good at like being by myself like i'm like content with being by myself and like being alone and like having my own time and stuff like that and like i really learned like how to be able to enjoy it and not have it be like something where it's like oh like if i'm alone like I'm gonna be upset like I have to be sad if I'm by myself but like no like this is going nowhere <laughs> um but yeah anyways I'm just like really I'm I'm happy that I can be able to be by myself and have it be a happy thing like I guess what I'm trying to say is like I'm happy that I don't need to have constant stimulation is that the word like have like people around all the time like I can like be happy with myself and like be my own best friend and stuff like that love to like see how long the clips and everything like all put together is and this video is long i don't know how much it will edit down to probably like shorter than what it is right now because it's so long like i think it's just because i've been like taking these clips where i just like talk and then my freaking sandwich clip like that was long as fuck all right but like for real though like i'm actually gonna go this time so i really I don't even know if I should keep saying the same thing over and over again, but yeah, so I'm gonna go. Alright, bye.